Welcome to the living room. Today's quick tip is brought to us by Pink Genie Photon. I do all of my circuits on strip board or ferro board. So the first thing I do is I cut it to size. And then I have my layout that I have downloaded. And that shows me where all the resistors, capacitors, transistors, and chips go in the circuit. Now there's also these little red squares that represent cuts. The strip board is strips of copper we need to cut that every so often for the circuit layout and depending on the complexity of the device sometimes there's a lot of these cuts and that's where I've screwed up in the past the thing is is the image of the layout is from the top but to get to the copper you flip the board over to do the cuts I use a little drill bit just kind of spin it a little bit and it cuts that copper right out of there so I'm looking at a mirror image of where I'm working so you have to what I was doing, I was taking a like a pick tool, and I would look at it from the top, and I would stick it through where the first cut was, flip it over, and then I would take a Sharpie and put it on the, that point, drop the point down, and mark it. And it's a little bit time-consuming, and I screwed it up a couple of times. I'd be like halfway done, three-quarters done, populating the circuit board, and I would go, wait a minute. And it's like, oh, man, I was off by one. And then you have to patch that cut put it in where it's supposed to go and things get messy. It's really frustrating. So I was speaking on the phone with Mr. Photon and he said, well, I use this Urfran View software, which is excellent. He said, I flip the image, mirror image, a horizontal flip it. And I thought, oh my goodness, that, that is genius. So this is a fantastic tip and I'm gonna be using this every time. So Urfran View, you know, I, I go to people's houses and most of the time, you know, be looking at pictures on their computer and they're using Windows Picture Viewer, which is frustrating. Um, let's go ahead and download Urfran View. This is wonderful free software. It's been around forever. You hit the space bar, it advances to the next picture. There's editing, there's plugins for it. Simple to use uh, and it does a lot more than Windows. So we just got to be careful once you've downloaded it. It's available, available for free all over the place. Just with every other piece of software nowadays, you want to uncheck the extras. It'll be like, you want to install Bonzi Buddy or like the Ask Jeeves toolbar. We don't want any of that. We just want our friend view. And also setting up your preferences. What that means is, you know, I check images only. That way, whatever image file it is, it opens with our friend view. But if you want to keep your Windows Picture Viewer around and only specifically use the Surfram View when you want to, then you go ahead and just select nothing and finish the install. So once we have Surfram View installed, and you don't you don't need to do this. I'm sure that using Windows uh, Picture Viewer or whatever photo application you have, you can find a way to flip that image so you're looking at it mirror image or reverse. Um, I just go ahead and quickly show you here with Urfran View, you open up the file, and if you go under the image on the toolbar at the top, scroll down to horizontal flip, or you can actually use the H hotkey, just slap that H, and there you go. You're looking at it exactly like you're looking at it when you need to cut those holes, not a mirror image, which keeps things simple for people like me. <laughs> So, what a wonderful, fantastic tip. Special thanks to Pink Jimmy Photon. Uh, I would encourage you to skip over to his channel, take a look at what he's got going on. He does custom mods. He does his own layouts for a lot of these circuits. And a lot of his stuff is, a, all of his stuff is excellent. Also, special thanks to Paul Stevenson at Paul in the Lab. I used his image here for the Devil's Triangle, which I made one of those, and it's... It's like the main sound module in this uh, noise box that I'm, I'm working on. So thank you very much to Mr. Stevenson. Paul in the lab is his site. He like donates all of his Vero layouts to the community for free. Uh, fantastic resource, really cool stuff that he's putting up there. A lot of it's music and guitar related. Some of it's electronics related. It's all really useful, cool stuff that he's come up with there. So, uh, peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah.